Hey, hey, hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. My name's Rain. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. I appreciate you being here. And welcome to Vlogmas Day 21. I wanna say it's Vlogmas Day 21. Uh, it'll be up here in, in the title. Today we're gonna be baking some cookies. Uh, I just got back from the store, so we're gonna get this going because I got a gift bag that I gotta give to somebody tomorrow. So I gotta get these these cookies rolling <laughs> and get my cookie tins out and uh, get my tissue paper and so if you want to hang out with me while I bake some cookies and see this nifty little thing idea that I got from Instagram then stick around because I'll be right back alrighty guys so I got these bowls set up you'll see why in a minute and then I got my tissue paper right here to put in my cookie tins and then I've got six cookie tins here because I got six gift bags but I do have a couple more cookie tins so I got a lot of cookies here I'm probably gonna have some extras so I'll probably make a couple extra cookie tins and then keep some for myself so this is one cookie tin some of these I got last year um, because they had treats at my work and there was cookie tin. There was like tins left over and somebody asked if I wanted them and I said, yeah. This one I got from the Dollar Tree. This is known for the holidays. I think this is one of the ones that I got from work last year. So I got two of those ones. And then, oh, let me see. I gotta preheat my oven, guys. I gotta preheat my oven. What is this saying? Bake, preheat oven, 350. So let's get this going. I'm gonna put it 355. Okay, and then these two I got from the Dollar Tree as well. Most wonderful time of the year. So I got those two, and then I got this one. I think I got this one work last year too. I think it had like those, those little like um, muffin things and they put the cookies in them, like the sugar cookie, like I don't know, or shortbread cookies in here. So um, yeah. Those are all of my cookie tins. I need to get my cooling racks out. So I should probably move these over to here. This is my baking round that I got from Pamper Chef. I freaking love this thing. I use it every year for my cookies, amongst other things. But this thing is amazing. And it works for so much stuff. Let me see if I can find my... Uh, cooling racks are down in here somewhere. All right, I got my cooling racks. Pamper Chef as well. My sister got me these one year for Christmas, and I freaking love them. So let me get these set up here. I sit them on top of each other like this, and then I can cool my cookies, and then I need... I need something to put my cookies on after they cool off until I can put them in the cookie tins. So, what am I gonna use for that? I'm gonna use this cookie sheet and just put paper towels on it so that I can stack my cookies there. I need this and, um, all right, so these are the cookies I got. I saw these ones and I thought they were, they looked yummy. Entenmann's cinnamon toffee cookie, ready to, ready to bake cookie dough. I just get the, the pre-cut ones because they're easier. Then I got chocolate brownie cookie because these, <laughs> these sounded yummy for me. I got chocolate chips and then I got Reese's and then I got two packs of the sugar cookies. So I'm gonna put these ones in the refrigerator right now, refrigerator right now, and we're gonna work on the sugar cookies first. Okay, these take 13 to 17 minutes to bake. So I got these out and I got these sprinkles. These are red sugar sprinkles. I got chocolate sprinkles. I got blue sprinkles and then I got rainbow ones. So what we're going to do is we're going to open these up and I'm going to put them in these little bowls here. And then I'm going to roll the sugar cookies up into little balls and then I'm going to roll them in the different ones. And then we're going to bake them like that. I saw this on Instagram. It looked freaking cool as heck. 
So that's what I want to do. I want to have some fun with these cookies this year and hopefully, you know what guys, let me open these up and I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, so we got blue, we got red, <laughs> rainbow, and chocolate sprinkles. Alright, so let's hope this turns out the way that they did on Instagram. So you just are supposed to roll these up into balls, just like that. And then you take it and you roll it around in here to get it coated. I should get a plate to put these on and then I can smush them down. So let me get a plate real quick. I'm just gonna sit that right there. So we got blue and then I'm gonna do red. This is gonna be so cool. I'm so excited. I hope it turns out. Getting creative in my old age, you guys. Getting creative. I think I'm gonna need more red, definitely. I'm just rolling it around in here to get it nice and coated. On the one that I saw on Instagram, they actually got, um, what are they called? They had the, they're like the sugar cookies with um, the little trees or the little snowmen in the middle of them. And they actually flattened these out and then they put those cookies in the middle of um, these ones, but I didn't, I can't get that lid off of that one, but I didn't see those ones at the store, so I didn't get those, and I figure these will be just as good, you know what I mean? This is going to take a little bit longer to get the sprinkles out because I can't, because there's little holes in it right there, so, um, yeah. Anyways, let's do a rainbow one. Hopefully I can, oh, I really hope these turn out the way that they did on Instagram because they looked so freaking cool you guys so freaking cool I'm gonna need more sprinkles some of these I can just do regular too because like maybe somebody's just gonna want like regular sugar cookies and not like the decorated ones and I've got like four, 48 so I'm just gonna do some of them like this and then some of them I'll do regular because I don't know if I'm going to have enough sprinkles to like do all of them. I don't even know if these chocolate ones will work as good as like the smaller ones because these chocolate sprinkles are a little bit bigger. But yeah. You guys, my son, um, his dad takes him to work on the weekends. And um, Sunday, his dad took him to work. And I had checked my phone a little bit uh, after he got to work and I saw a text from my son and he he drove from our house to work in his dad's car on the freeway for the first time and I guess he did really really good so I'm so proud of him he said it was a little weird um, you know, driving on the freeway. Uh, but he said, I just kept it at 60, um, maybe a little below and just took my time. And I was like, good job, buddy, good job. So I just gotta get him his dang permit, man. Uh, his dad asked if he was off work tomorrow. So I'm thinking he might be wanting to do something with him tomorrow. So I'm, usually I take him to go uh, take the written on Wednesdays because that's when they have um, like open appointments you know what I mean where you where you can just walk in and you don't have to make an appointment so I'm thinking about uh, asking his dad if he wants to take him because he has like when you go in and you pay you get two tries for the one payment and when I paid last time he only did it the once the, the one time so he has one more time that he can go in so I'm thinking maybe I'll ask his dad if he wants to take him uh, tomorrow to go try and get his permit and maybe having his dad with him will make a little bit of a difference anyways I'm gonna get off of here and I'm gonna finish getting these all ready and then I'll be back to show you what they all look like before I put them in the oven and then we'll see what they look like once I take them out. I'm so excited, you guys. I'm so excited. So stick around. Alrighty, guys. I got 12 cookies ready to rock and roll. So let's get a thumbnail. 
cookies and more cookies. Let's bake. <laughs> Anyways, all right. So I got these ones all covered. So I'm going to flatten them out a little. I guess I don't have to flatten them out too much because um, they're gonna they're gonna flatten out when they bake. You know what I'm saying? So and maybe I can coat them a little bit more. And I think they cook for like I don't know 17 minutes. 13 to 17 minutes, I think is what it said. So I'm just gonna flatten these out and put them on the baking sheet or my cook, my, my, my round, my cooking round. Jeez, can I speak? Oh, I'm so excited. I can't wait to try these and see how they taste. Maybe I should, maybe I don't need to roll them. Maybe I can just coat them like in the little squares that they're in. You know what I'm saying? Like maybe I can just do it that way. Oh, we're mixing, mixing stuff together, guys. So some of these are gonna have a couple different things, but it's not gonna be, you're not gonna be able to tell too much. Like some of these have, like the red ones have like chocolate sprinkles in them. And, uh, but that's okay, that's okay. Alrighty guys, there you go. I could probably fit a couple more on there. Alrighty, I added a couple more. So I'm gonna put these in the oven now that it's preheated. And uh, we'll let them bake for, let me check the directions again to make sure I do this right. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be a mess after this. It says to bake for 13 to 17 minutes. So I'm gonna set the timer on my microwave. All right, I set the timer for 15 minutes. So I'm gonna get off of here, I'm gonna let these bake, and then as soon as the timer goes off, we will get them out and see what they look like. I'm super excited and I have enough so I'll be able to try a couple and see how they are. Stay tuned. All right, guys, the timer went off. So let's check on these bad boys and see. <gasps> oh, they look so good, you guys, but I think they need a few more minutes. All right, so I'm gonna let them bake for a couple more minutes and then we'll take them out, okay? Alrighty, guys, I gave them a couple more minutes. So now I'm gonna take them out and we'll let them cool. Look at that, you guys! Ah, I'm so excited! Oh my gosh, these are gonna turn out so freaking good. So I'm gonna let these cool off and then I got some more ready to go in and I'm gonna put those in and I'm gonna get these all baked up and then I'll come back and show you what the final product looks like and we'll bake some more cookies and then we'll try them and see how they taste but they look freaking delicious you guys. This, like when I saw this on Instagram, I was like, I have to try that. And these are the exact sugar cookies that they use. The Pillsbury, um, the Pillsbury sugar cookie cookie dough, safe to eat raw, eat or bake. Well, I'm not gonna eat it raw, but this is the exact cookie dough that they used. So that's why when I got to the store and I saw it, like if they didn't have the, that kind of dough, I probably wouldn't have done the sugar cookie thing. But since they had that, I was like, all right, I'm gonna get these and then I'm gonna go get the sprinkles and we're gonna give this a try and see how it turns out. So I'm like super excited. So stay tuned guys, I'll be back and we'll have like, we'll start putting these all in the cookie tins and stuff. And so, so much fun. I love this so much guys. Don't go anywhere, keep hanging out with me. <laughs>
guys, I'm back and all the cookies are done. These ones right here, the cinnamon toffee, I think it was cinnamon toffee, smell phenomenal, you guys. All right, so, ooh, I don't wanna drop any. So we got the cinnamon toffee right there and here's the rest of them. I've been a bacon fool tonight. All right, and now, ah, let's put a cookie tin together. So we got one plain sugar cookie. We've got the one with the red sprinkles. Of course, the rainbow one. The chocolate sprinkles. The blue sprinkles. Let's get, this is the Reese one. Regular chocolate chip, of course. We've got the brownie one. And we're gonna put in the cinnamon toffee. So that's one of each. So we got one, two, four, five, six, eight cookies in here. So we need to put, let's put a couple more. We'll put another chocolate chip, another brownie. Let's get one of the red ones. Let's put another toffee one. I think that should be good for this cookie tin. And then I'm gonna wrap it like this. And put the lid on. Oh no. I keep losing parts of this like gold stuff. It was falling all over the place at work today. All right, so cookie tin number one is done. Let's get this next one. We're gonna get toffee, regular sugar cookie, one of the red ones, one of the chocolate sprinkles, rainbow, blue. We've got the Reese, that's chocolate chip, the chocolate, hmm. Let's put another one of these ones, one of these ones, another Reese, chocolate chip. How many was that? I'm losing count, guys. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I think that should be good. So let's wrap this up and put the lid on. Cookie tin number two. I love this so much. All right, so one of the red ones kind of fell apart, so I ate it. You guys, they're freaking delicious. Freaking delicious. I have four more cookie tins to do. So, one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, hmm, ten, eleven. I think eleven should be good for each cookie tin. We don't need to load everybody up too much. All right, I'm gonna get the rest of the cookie tins done and then I'll be right back when I'm all finished. Alrighty, guys, I found a couple more little cookie tins. I put like six of them in here. So maybe that'll go to Junior's uh, friend at work that he's getting a Christmas gift for. So I got this last cookie tin that I had. So I'm gonna go ahead and put a few in here. I kept some for myself, of course. Three, four, five. Mm, I wanna keep that one for me, six. So I'll put six in here. All right, and that's all my cookie tins. I'm so excited. These, phenomenal idea. They're so good, so good. Highly recommend getting the sugar cookie and then getting the sprinkles and try it because it just amps up the cookies to the next level. But anyways, sorry guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're new to the channel, I hope you'll join the family. Join Nene's Glam Squad. It's completely and totally free. We would love to have you a part of the family. Just go down below, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you turn the notification bell up to all. That way you can get notified of any and all future uploads. I do a lot of different things on this channel. Mask Monday, Get Ready With Me Wednesday, Adventure Fridays, unboxings, hauls, vlogs, anything that I want to share, I put on my channel. And I'm sure that you will find something that would be of interest to you. I'm also 
full into almost the end of Vlogmas now. I can hardly believe. Today is Tuesday the 19th and Christmas is Monday. Holy crap. Make sure you give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think about the cookies down in the comments below. And uh, I hope you guys all have an amazing morning, afternoon, or evening. No matter what time of day it is that you're watching this, take care, stay safe, and I hope I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys!